chips. Mm-mm-mm. But yeah, y'all, what y'all eating? What y'all having for dinner? Did y'all cook? Phew, thou shalt not steal. You broke a commandment, ma'am. Yeah. You finna do all that preaching and you got a stolen bottle <laughs> of Tabasco sauce in your position. And then you That's did all that do. preaching today. See, now, when I go through your lab tomorrow, I'm gonna just keep pointing out, thou shalt not steal. I'm gonna point out that commandment and See how you just shamelessly don't give a fuck about putting it to Basco so yo your spirit ain't conflicted at all. She God damn didn't tell you to take the Tabasco sauce back or you was wrong. He tell you everything else, but he ain't say, my child. Stall them folks. The Tabasco eat. down. You do not need you are eat with Q. You are my child. To. That's why you, you gotta be out to still Tabasco. <laughs> you got Stop it, Trey. You got to watch out for them false prophets around here stealing this shit, but getting on here preaching and sweating and carrying on doing all that damn hollering. And you sitting up there with stolen items and been lying the whole damn time. I was Y'all got to watch out for people like that, I'm telling you. They'll get you. <laughs> Did y'all Yeah, Taylor, go to my live from last night. I got the picture up of when she opened the bag. She just ripped the bag open and the bottle was sitting there. And from the angle, you think it could be a little miniature jam, but then now she went on and held the bottle up. And so it's it, always on my live from last night, which is in the exposing the real Eat With Q playlist. We like 49 videos deep now since, I think, December. We get to work. We put in work. Thing did y'all do? Did y'all put? But how I started and how I'm doing you now is totally different. Totally different. Anything in the crock pot? I think I want to do the um. What's that crock pot meal, you guys? The Mississippi sliders or something like that. I think I want to do that. Um. Very soon. Where's your husband? Um, but yeah, you guys, that was so why weird. your husband didn't show up to the 600 k celebration. He ain't no shit about it. Why not? He could have been on the Fibarissima channel. Ooh, also, free, also free, also free game, Q. Like you could have been streaming your 600 k celebration on the well, oh well, you on use stream yards, never mind. Right. But if you were on stream yards, you could have been on both channels. Go ahead. Breaking news. I got something. I'm going to read to you, okay? Now, uh -huh. this is on the community wall, and I'm going to share it out of a supporter. Hey, Big Grabowski, what's going on, girl? Trey, this is very informative, and I know this is um, pretty much um, the truth coming from this person because um, she uh, kind of sort of lives this life in real life. So listen. She said, greetings, kings and queens, caring and sharing once again with you all. Listen, if you are an American, right, who married a foreigner outside of the USA and is filing for that spouse, you need that legal documentation showing proof of that marriage. Ceremonial marriages are not, nor are they legal as a proof of marriage. Ceremonial marriages are not recognized or acceptable as a marriage in the United States. You need legal documentation, such as a marriage license or a marriage certificate with a seal. The American spouse, hence Q, who is the petitioner slash sponsor, who is sponsoring that spouse, must demonstrate that he or she has the means to support that spouse when they come to the United States and must submit three years of tax returns because you need to demonstrate that you earn enough and have the financial means to support that male or female spouse who is coming to the United States by showing proof of current employment and must show banking information and proof of residence, a place for them to live for your spouse. If all goes well, then the spouse could be in the in, then the spouse can be in the United States a minimum of 13 to 14 months. Now, unless the spouse that's in the foreign country, pay attention, unless the spouse that's in the foreign country has other issues 
legal issues or the American spouse has financial